Saturday. I'm going to Bibo restaurant. It's it's a new restaurant in town that has been hyped. So I just want to go. I try the food. I try everything. I'm just craving burgers. So that's what definitely I'm going to order. Yeah. So let's go to Bibo. We do a review of the restaurant. Yeah. I hope you guys will enjoy. I'm starting this new segment on my channel where we review different type, types of restaurants. So just comment down below which next restaurant do you think I should go to. Or I'll also show the prices so that it will be easier for you. If you are on a budget, it will be easier for you to decide which restaurant is good for you. So let's go to Weibo restaurant. So guys, you'll allow me to do a voiceover because there are a lot, a lot of people here. So it was quite difficult for me to talk at the same time, eat and do the vlog. So the place is so beautiful. It's a, it has a good ambience. Um, it was so creative. It's so pretty, so greenish. And yeah, it's just near Mudangari Drive when you're going on your way to Lovington. So yeah that's how the place looks like we really really enjoyed the food was so good though it took quite a while good morning beautiful people so i don't know whether to start the vlog or just to continue because uh I'm going to another restaurant as you've seen I'm just from Weibo restaurant in Modangari Road so I'm going to do a review so we compare between the Weibo and I'm going to a restaurant called Zaytun I think near village market if I'm not wrong so we do comparison um, according to me Weibo was good the only thing was it took quite a lot of time for us to get our orders so but everything else was okay so I'm going to review the time customer care the food the environment ambience the waiters so after i got to zaitun is it zaitun i'm not really sure but i'll write the name here so yeah after i go to zaitun then we'll do a comparison between buibo and zaitun i want to start a new segment on my channel where we visit restaurants and we review the food we review the customer care service we review everything of that restaurant so if you like this kind of videos don't forget to subscribe don't forget to share don't forget to like it supports my channel a big 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 time so yeah um i look so good today yeah that's my outfit of the day when i reach to village market i'll show you guys my outfit of the day i'm going to lunch with my mentee my baby so you'll also see her in this channel she also has a channel I will link it below if she's okay i'll share her channel on my channel here or we'll do something together whichever so let me go to zaitun then i'll hit you guys when i'm already there i know you told your friend you're not okay and tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way and guess you're trying to stay strong and fake a smile until i look but I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey As you fade away, yeah, 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 yeah. As you fade away Yeah, I'm about to fade away Cause every time I wake up I feel like it's Monday Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain All of a sudden I don't look at anything the same way Got a build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient, okay Just let me be me And so guys, we just left Bad Zaytun because A, it was so pricey So we just bought uh, one scoop of ice cream and uh, we left the place so we opted to come to see this the one in village market so yeah we want to taste the food and see how it goes and also we we'll give a review of the place customer care service the quality of the food how much longer it, it takes when we order plus when the food comes here so yeah i'll be back when the food is here i hope you guys enjoy this kind of video remember i'm doing um, a review of Guibo restaurant and Sijis uh, restaurant
just like to say hi to you guys and I'll leave her link of her YouTube channel. I'll write it here or I'll leave it in the description box. So when you leave this video, go and watch her video on the same and more more interesting videos. So I'll let her introduce herself. <laughs> market at CJ and we're going to have some amazing food. Uh, they look amazing already so yeah. <laughs> yeah so guys subscribe to her channel Vanessa Aika right yeah subscribe to her channel for she has very very good videos for traveling lifestyle and all that so let's dig in our food is already here The food took less than less than five minutes to be here, so that was so quick. And also, the guy who's serving us helped us choose the menu. No, helped us choose the food. And yeah, let's just have a taste of it, and I'll let you know what I think about the food. two restaurants that I visited that's it that is Bibo restaurant and CJ's restaurant so I will start with the ambience um both restaurants are beautiful and uh, Bibo is located in Mudangari road and it's um near trees good scenery it's so quiet good music also CJ's is located in village market though it's a busy busy mall but I tend to find they've decorated, they've done a good decor in the restaurant. So both hotels, both restaurants are quite good in ambience. So I will give Buibo restaurant ambience 8 out of 10. Then CJ 7.5 out of 10 because it's quite a busy place. Then after that we, uh, we go to time. The amount of time we used to ordering food to when the food was um, served to us. For Buibo restaurant, it took quite a while. We even had our soda and we almost finished the soda before the food was here. So it took like 10 to 15 minutes for Buibo restaurant and CJ's it took five minutes. Mind you, CJ's is so, so, so busy, but they deliver the food quite on time. So I will give Buibo restaurant um, five out of 10, CJ's seven out of 10. So when it comes to customer care service, both restaurants are okay, but I found Bibo quite overwhelmed because of there were a lot of people and the staff were, I, I guess, a few or I, I don't know. So they were just up and down, up and down. Then for CJ's, the restaurant is busy, but you could find there's someone at the entrance who will guide you where to sit. They had like, I don't know, it's ear earpiece where they communicate with someone inside and they tell you, please reserve a table for two, a table for three. Um, and even after you get the table, the, uh, the, the waiter who is serving you, he will come after every like 10 minutes, five minutes, just to find out if you need anything, if the food is okay, do you need extra top up? They were so concerned in short. So I will give Weibo restaurant maybe six out of 10. Um, what else? Uh, CJ's nine out of 10. I mean, customer care service is what everyone looks for in anywhere you go. Uh, um, in any service that you're looking for. So I will give CJ's nine out of 10. They really do well. They really care for their customers. Next is the food. Do I need to say the food was so, so good. For both restaurants, the food was so good. For Bibo, I took a burger and fries. Um, for CJ's, I took chicken wings and plantain and uh, a juice. No iced tea. Yeah, for Bibo, I took soda, Coca-Cola soda. So I will say for Bibo, 
the burgers were quite good very very good i can't complain about the burgers though the fries were so ordinary we thought like they would have some spice on it or just spice it up yeah um but it was it was good it was perfect i will give food for bibo restaurant 8.5 out of 10 cgs i will give it 8.9 out of 10 for amount the amount we paid both restaurants are affordable i must say they're not that expensive um it's pocket friendly for bibo i think the burger was 980 shillings the soda one was 150 shillings for cgs um the chicken wing plus the plantain was 1450 shillings and the iced tea was 450 shillings uh yeah i guess that's it it's it's quite affordable and the portions for both uh, restaurants are it's 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 a portion that you'll get full and even uh carry a takeaway back home so yeah basically that's it i hope you guys enjoyed uh if you want more of these types of videos please let me know suggest down below comment down below uh which other restaurant which the next two restaurants would you like for me to go review and also um before i forget the zaitun is it called zaitun badge zaitun if i'm not wrong it was so so expensive so we had to look for plan b that's why we went to cg's so we according to our pockets right now uh we could not make it to eat at zaitun we thought we would but where the menu was was something else but i guess we'll like to go visit the restaurant again at least eat different cuisine from different type of countries yeah it's still in my bucket list i have a huge bucket list of the restaurants i would like to visit here in nairobi and yeah keep it locked so if you like these videos please 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 share comment subscribe and let's grow the channel the comments and the likes help my channel grow a lot yeah so thank you so much for watching thank you for so much for your time and see you on the next vlog bye